Hello, this is Ralph, and uh, I'm going to be doing sort of a Genesis mining update today with a little bit of commentary on what I'm going to call the Bitcoin bounce. And when I woke up this morning, I was a little surprised, went to bed, and Bitcoin was like at $1,170. And then I woke up, and it was down to about what it was before it took that incredible, you know, bounce upwards down to about $940, $945. So what I did is instead of panicking, I just went ahead and bought when it was down to $947, went ahead and bought $100 worth of Bitcoin, and I fully expected it to come right back up. And so far, that's what it, it has been doing. Right now, it looks like on Poloniex, we're at $973 per Bitcoin. So I expect to be doing pretty well. I don't know why Bitcoin crashed. Some commentators are saying that, you know, folks in China got a little antsy. They were expecting a, uh, a bubble to burst. So they went ahead and preemptively burst the bubble on there uh, by themselves. But, you know, other people are very bullish on Bitcoin. Uh, I'm one of them, and uh, yeah, we thank you people in China for the cheap Bitcoin, <laughs> and uh, yeah, I'm really investing investing in it as much as I can, and uh, so far, pretty happy with the results. Now, I'm going to shift back to my Poloniex account. There's my little alien guy, and where's Genesis, rather, there's Genesis. This is what I did today with a little bit of my Bitcoin uh, investment. I went ahead and I've got a, uh, a mining contract, the Shea 256 with uh, Genesis. And I went ahead and took a little bit of that $100 that I converted to Bitcoin this morning. And I upgraded my uh, mining power on Genesis. And right now I'm at 8.50. Uh, bought an extra 0.5 terahash this morning and so far I'm, I, I'm very happy with the result today let's just go look at the earnings here there we go see over time you know my Bitcoin earnings have been going up uh, very happy with the uh, Shea uh, 256 mining contract it's a contract that doesn't have a definite expiration date it's called the lifetime contract, which you know is a little bit of a misnomer because it, it's a contract that's guaranteed to last as long as it's profitable for Genesis to be offering it. And with the price of Bitcoin going up and up and up and yeah, taking bounces, but coming right back up, I, I think it's a pretty safe bet. So it's one I'm willing to make. And what I do, is uh, as I make uh, Bitcoin on Genesis, I go ahead and reinvest it I right back into Genesis. When I get enough to buy another mining contract, I go ahead and buy it. When I uh, get a little extra money ahead, I'll sock a little bit of that away into savings and I'll sock a little bit of that away into Genesis mining because from my experience, Genesis Mining has been a reliable way to mine and accumulate Bitcoin. I've tried mining small scale on my own. I haven't had much luck with it. I'm not a computer geek, a computer whiz. So uh, I have to deal with other folks who are a little better on that than I am. And so far, Genesis Mining has been a reliable partner in that. Now, I've got two uh, contracts or two programs active on Genesis right now. This is the Shea 256 uh, Lifetime Bitcoin uh, Mining Contract. And then down below it, see another contract that I got in because somebody else bought into it using my promo code. And that is the X11. And this is interesting because here we see, uh, let's go down here. Uh, this, I, I started out kind of low and then somebody else bought and uh, it increased a little bit. 
and I had it writing on dash because I thought dash should do pretty good. And then as an experiment, I pointed it towards uh, BTC, thinking that's when BTC price really started to take off. And so I wanted to see what little mining power I had on the X11 uh, program, see if that would get me enough BTC to make it worthwhile. And you can see that's where it just flattened out. And I really wasn't making a whole lot on BTC because I had very, very, very low mining strength on the X11. On the Shea 256, I've got excellent mining power. And that's why I'm able to mine Bitcoin uh, very well. But on this other one, X11, I'm very, very low. So uh, what I did is when I noticed that BTC wasn't getting me much of a profit, I went ahead and pointed it right back at Dash. And since I made that move, it's been going up. So the point I'm trying to make here is that no matter what kind of mining contract you buy, you've got to be careful because there is some risk. But with most of these mining contracts, like, well, like with the Shea 256 and the X11 contract offered on Genesis, you've got choices. You can choose to mine BTC, you can mine Dash, I uh, believe you can mine Monero. Uh, there's just a whole list of coins that you can, uh, you can mine. And so if for some reason one coin becomes unprofitable, you can shift over and point your mining strength at another coin. And that's what I did here on the Shea, excuse me, the X11. And I'm glad I did. Otherwise, I'd be one of those people complaining that, oh my God, I'm not making any money. It's a scam. But, you know, you have to be proactive with it. And you just have to use your head when you're investing and just do what you think is going to pan out. And be ready just in case it doesn't pan out. That's that's what I do. I mean, I, I think that Genesis Mining is a pretty good deal. But at the same time, I do not invest any more into this program than what I am willing to lose. And that, I think, is just good investment advice. Uh, sometimes good investments turn sour. Uh, like, you know, hearing about Bitcoin this morning. Uh, I had faith that it was going to rise again, and it has, and I have faith in Genesis Mining, and so far I don't think that faith has been misplaced. So this is Ralph signing out, wishing you guys happy mining, and uh, you know, take care. If you want to buy a mining contract with Genesis Mining, feel free to use my affiliate code. You will get, I believe it's still a 3% discount on every uh, mining contract purchase that you make and I get a little bit of hash power back in return so it's kind of a win-win situation and uh, just wish you guys happy mining and all the best thanks for watching